hello! Good evening or good day, depending on where you are in the world. Welcome to the stream! So tonight, we're gonna be finally continuing Julia Among the Stars. We only have a few mysteries left, and I think we might be able to finally finish this tonight. Because we've... I would think we might have already explored like all of the planets that we could explore. So... Yeah, let's see what'll happen. I, I really don't know what'll happen at the end of this game. Like, I don't know what Ra Rachel's gonna do, really. <laughs> but yeah, welcome everyone! Welcome Ikan Raid, Arklin, Reeker! And congrats Reeker on being first! Woo! Yeah, space! Anyway, how y'all doing tonight? Hope y'all doing well. Hope y'all had a good meal. Let me switch to the game scene real quick. Alright, here we are. Let's continue from where we left off. So, let's look at our log. And, as you can see, I mean, we don't even have any current goals on this planet, but I've... No, we didn't just land here, did we? No, I'm at, I'm not actually sure what we're doing here anymore. <laughs> but, I mean, look, we still have objectives in other planets, so... We have this one. This is the very first that we explored. It's just explore the solar system. Mm -hmm. We're already doing that. But we have this. Go to Phaedrus at night and kill Zir with a weapon obtained from the depths of Zenobia. So we have to go to Zenobia, which is like the ocean planet. And we need to search for some means to calibrate the weapon from orbit. And yeah, we gotta explore this submarine. So let's actually get out of this planet then. Because Phaedrus is the one where we had to like mess with the air inside so that it wasn't gonna just blow up at any moment. But yeah, it seems like we have shit to do. Um, last time we ac acquired like a couple of blueprints to upgrade Mobot. And those should allow him to, like, do shit in this planet. There was a signal, which I believe we checked out. But I think we also got a way to go underwater, if I'm not mistaken. Anyway, let's go. Let's descend. Wreck submarine. I wonder what I'm going to find inside. I'm sure it won't be anything pretty. Just one dead body after another. That's about Pull right. yourself together, Rachel. There is nothing you can do. Yeah. So we're going in here because we haven't yet, but yeah, we're gonna explore all this. We haven't gone here yet. Ooh. Those mushrooms glow in the dark. Let's get a specimen. Yes, I, want to know I was gonna more. say, let's get a sample. So we got some bioluminescent mushrooms, it seems. Let's check it in their analyzer. This bioluminescent mushroom is similar to the earth mushroom known as Omphalotus olearius. The cause of the glow is the same enzyme luciferous. This points to the existence of common biological elements throughout our galaxy. Cool. Oh yeah, glowing mushroom. Okay. Didn't speak of any other additional they special properties. But why? What were they doing here? And we'll find why out. drive full speed in such dangerous terrain? Maybe so there were questions I'm never going to get an answer for. Oh well, hang on, we might get answers inside. But I'm just saying, like maybe they were fleeing from something, and that's why they had to go in quick. Ooh, this dark, dark and spooky. Robot, activate your IR camera, please. Of course. Just Ooh, what's this gonna look like? I am unable to activate what? it anymore. You mean it's broken? The IR operations oh. plugin license expired 30 Bruh. years ago. Are you serious? <laughs> There's no bloody way they would use the timed fuck? licenses for such a mission. <laughs> According to my calculations, it looks more like a programming error. Nobody counted on a mission as long as 500 years. Incredible. So, what should we do? I have a backup solution. Bring Just it solution. On. However, Ooh. for some oh. reason, I can't locate the important spots yeah. here. So you are on your own. <laughs> oh, 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 okay. I thought he just like lit up this one spot. I was like, what? But okay, that's cool. Observation. This metal was once part of the submarine's hull. It From must outside? have been thrown away when the submarine crashed. A scuba gear. This scuba gear is broken beyond repair. And it didn't save anyone. Clearly. Small crate. I think we are wasting our time. Julia! There are too many of these crates. Alright, let's leave them be for the time being. I no one ever wants to check the crates. I think we are there are too many Shut of Shut up. Right, 
I just want to look at some crates. I think there are two. Alright, let's... Him. <laughs> I refuse. Look at that crates. <laughs> anyway. Ooh, le lever? Ooh. Hang on, though. Hang on. Yeah, I was hoping this wasn't like a creature or something. I guess it's not. Hopefully, fingers crossed. What is this? What is that? I can't really expect it. Ooh. There's a room here, too. Down the ladder. Okay, there's... There's a few places we can go. Alright, Mobot can't highlight stuff. So, I'm just trying to look very carefully. Make sure we don't miss anything. Let's... Weeds? What is that? That's a party sample. And let's examine it too. Those weeds are interesting. I wonder if they're similar to the oceanic life on Earth. That's a good question, Rachel. However, keep in mind that we know next to nothing about ocean life on Earth. Oops, someone I made know. a typo. I wonder <laughs> how much it's changed there. Maybe now it's all ocean just life one big ocean, like here on Xenobia. Maybe Xenobia is Earth. Anyway, let's check. Let's check. What is this? Julia's slowly becoming more and more in a hinge. I know, right? I feel that way too. Biological analysis reveals that those alien plants are actually small invertebrates forming plant-like shapes by massing together. Okay. Ew. <laughs> it's somehow just creepier to me when I know that they're a bunch of tiny, tiny creatures together. Ugh. Uh, anyway. Okay, let's go down the ladder. Apology, the oh. path below is blocked by debris. I would estimate it's from the crash. Well, never mind. How about to the front? Just look at this. Oh, oh! Mobot, switch ah! your light. We don't want to scare it away. We want to scare it away? It's scaring me away. Get out of there. <laughs> what the hell is that? Now this is something you should study. Uh, no kidding. It's beautiful. It has eyes. I wonder what the source of that translucent light is. I would bet yeah. on the chemical origin. <laughs> it's embracing the corpse as if it's trying to comfort it. I don't think it's trying to comfort it. The body has a data pad stuck in a pocket. Do you uh, want to recover uh, it? That would be great. However, we need to lure that creature away so you won't hurt so it. So you don't Robot, hurt it. I think it'll hurt shine us. Shine light on it. It should go away. A uh, it's moving. You. Uh, uh. uh oh. Uh oh. Ah! Oh no 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 no! Don't you dare! Don't you dare! Don't you dare! No 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 no! Ah! So here comes the life form. What do we do? Shoot it! It's obvious that they're sensitive to the light. It lures them closer. Shoot it! I wonder if we can find. Then we get a laser gun or something. Shoot it! Mobot. That audio upgrade we built inside uh, you. No, I don't want that. Generating sound frequencies. <laughs> there is limited support to that function. That's a great idea, Rachel. I will create a custom interface so you can easily control that. Uh, Let's experiment a bit first. Whatever you do, be careful. I've had my share of electrical charges already. Don't worry. Just remember that to trigger a response, you might want to go slowly. Uh oh, do You're I have to move sure my mouse slowly? Ah! Oh boy, here we go. Oh, what are we meant to do? I don't. I'm scared. I feel like it'll jump scare me. What am I supposed to do? I don't know what I'm doing. What the fuck am I doing? Am I trying to make like a sound that will lure it? But... But I have to go slowly, right? I hate it. Stop looking at me! What's this doing? They seem to react to the pulse. Yeah. But there is still no change in behavior. Oh, jump scare me like that, Rachel. Let's try it with the frequency now. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Aha. Ooh. Now we have Ooh. much better control over that life form. 
We can lure them using the light and repel them. It doesn't the like this sound, okay. Why do you think it's scared of that sound? Hmm. I believe we might have just discovered something used by some of her natural enemies. Maybe. In that case, I don't want to meet its natural Neither enemies. Neither do I. All right. I will construct a simplified interface and let's try to trap it. Okay. Listen, if that thing looks like that and it's scared of something else, you don't want to know what it's scared of. So those weeds are in. I wonder if that's a. However, I know. Hmm. I wonder how. Maybe now it's like here. So we don't go there. Let's. Um, I have to move this again. I mean, let's go here. I guess. Fuck that other place. <laughs> Ugh. In this oh metal rods. This rusty metal brace was originally designed to keep things apart. Okay, okay. Um, uh, the crates. They're just gonna tell me off if I try to look at the crates. So, uh, ooh, for the I am detecting an unstable environment. Oh, do you really want me to proceed? No, we're not going to risk that. Let's proceed with caution. Okay. Thank We're in the deep sea too, the evolution down here just goes crazy. Yup. And this entire planet is ocean! Oh man, it's like being in Subnautica again, except it's point and click. Ugh. Uh, is there anything else here? Mobot's not telling me anything. I can't go down the corridor, apparently. I'm looking for stuff. I'm not seeing stuff, though. So, I... I think I'll... What's the use of this place, then? I didn't even get anything here. Hmm. Because, look, I can't... There are yeah, two. All right. exactly. So... Exit to storage? I mean, where was I? Oh, this isn't really a passageway anyway, I guess. Well, what's the point of this? I can't even go here. Eh? Okay. Well, I mean, there's really only this. Let's... Lure? I don't think I want to lure it. Do I? Why would I want to lure it? I, I guess it's because... Okay. Form. We need to get them out of the way. So we have to lure the life form? So that we can get up the ladder? There doesn't really seem to be anywhere else to go, so... I can't move. We need to get... Let's try again. Hopefully, you're better prepared this time. Whoa. Whoa. Uh. Whoa. Uh. Oh. She's trying to feed on the strange stuff on the pipe. Oh, it likes the stuff. Okay. Retreat? Let's just wait outside. We need to come up with a better plan. Oh wait, this is not. Oh, no! I thought they. I just meant. I thought it meant like retreat from. Let's you know, again. Hopefully. The encounters so that we could like move past it because it was like distracted by the weeds. It's just a tentacly sea dog. Oh, I don't trust it. She's trying to. Fi yeah. Okay. Isn't that good? <laughs> Bell? It doesn't react to anything. Time to retreat and wait until it gets back to the corpse. Do you think you can sneak by, my bot? I am not even going to try that. One electrocution was enough. Damn. Let's just wait. Okay, so don't lure it. Okay. Because otherwise Let's it'll just hopefully. stay with the weeds and not respond to us at all. So repel it? Hmm. You've scared it away. It I wanted to fast. scare it away. Oh. Well, what the? Let's try again. What? Do Hopefully. I lure it twice? What do you want me to do here? Oh, we'll find out. Right. So it's gonna do that. She's. It doesn't react to it. Do you think you can- I am not one elect. What? 
What am I supposed to do here? It doesn't react. I really don't understand. I can't repel wait. it. I can't attract it. What do you want me to do here? Unless again, is there something I missed? Like what? I feel like I looked everywhere. Let's see bathroom. Okay. There's only like a few passageways and the ladder is blocked and we can't go through here. It's like we have to get through the ladder somehow. Hmm. I mean, it's kind of hard to tell if I'm missing anything because I can't just highlight shit. And we can't go up that vent or anything. Alright. I can't really go down, so I have to go there. Like, there's nothing here. Yeah. I gotta somehow get through that thing. Somehow. Didn't exit outside. So we're just back here. That doesn't help. Damn it. Uh Wobot doesn't want to sneak past it. Let's take away her favorite treat. Oh I didn't realize that was this area. I see. So because we're Let's removing the weeds, it won't get distracted anymore. Got it, got it. Let's try again. Hopefully. I see. It was lit, so like I didn't really recognize the area. <laughs> Alright, now we can attract it. Oh wait, it's oh. oh god, we have to get it closer. Whoa. Go away. Huh? What do we do? Change of perspective is confusing? Exactly. What am I supposed to do here? What if I can't... Can I really not just scare it away like before? Hmm. You, it loses interest. I wanted to... I wanted it to go away. Oh wait, does it just go to the corpse when it... Let's try oh, again. Maybe. Hopefully. I mean, this is time to wear lurid. I don't want it to get too close. But at the same time, clearly we had to take away the weeds. Woo! It's getting too close. I know! E. Uh, not freaking... I don't know what to do. Let's try again, hopefully. I tried luring it twice and it just... <laughs> can't we get a turn or something? We can't really interact with anything while we're doing this. Kind of confused about the purpose of this whole interaction. Here we can't reach you the door Just behind the close. We need to find out how to deal with this beauty. This beauty, it's terrifying. Uh can't the door be closed? What is this? Huh. Let's try again, again. hopefully. Okay. So luring it three times is too close, but luring it two times is not enough. Uh what? Um. 
I think I might as well do here. I just keep going back and forth. This is gonna get tired. <laughs> like, how long can I choose? <laughs> Yeah, one more is bad, right? Just exit. Okay. Just what is the door behind you? What is blocking your way? I'm fucking. Oh, I can take the rod. I didn't realize that. Oh. <laughs> I, I don't know, I like interacted with it once and I just assumed that that was the end of it. Okay. Oh, I get it! We could like put the. Shit, where do we put it though? Because. We can put the metal rod to like hold open some doors. This one? Uh. I wonder. Oh wait, did we just use it here? What do we do? Because clearly we were meant to probably put that in the doors that Mobot's referring to that keep closing. But how do I actually use it? It's my thing. Um I mean, that one, this one, like... It, no, 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 don't take that. I'm thinking, like, could we hold this open? I don't know. Uh, I'm really Wait, getting... We need to get... Maybe I'll get an option Let's when try I do this properly. again. Otherwise, I'm not really sure. Here, let's try it. Twice, maybe. Just ex the door behind you is full. Spock it with the rod. I know, right? What? Where are we meant to put the rod? I don't understand. Freaking. What? Oh, no, what fucking door? It's talking about. There's nothing. You mean? This is the only door I can think of because this automatically closes. The thing is, I don't get an option to put rods there. I don't really know what the game wants me to do. Uh. It's not like I'm missing anything else. Oh wait, Mobot really can't use this thing anyway. Uh, I just want to get off the damn ladder. <laughs> Let me in! Okay, so in the thing, right, we would be in the storage area, so... Pass me this door. That he says he can't retreat to. But it's like, again, what do we do? Let me try to find shit. I think we are wasting our- there are- alright, let's- I have a metal rod, what do I do with it? Uh... Hmm... Yeah, there's like nothing here, what if I move this? Does that change anything outside? Does that let the state open longer? No. No, heck? Supposed to keep the door open. Uh, we need the thing here, and that's like the only thing we need to do at this point. It's that and the virtual. So, where would you put metal rods? I think we. There are two. All right. 
Where? What is this room? I haven't been here. What do we have? Maybe it's like locked. Like I swear, we can't. We cannot go in here. It doesn't let us. Like I'm just making sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. I can't go there, and I also can't go there. The only way to do this is through there. And I, it's not like I can't even like put the weeds back or anything to like manipulate it. And you can't really do anything while you're doing the luring thing. There's just nothing. I think we. There are two. All right, let's. Exit outside doesn't really do anything. Starts this over. I can't. We need to get. Right. So, what's the door that you're having a problem with? Because I do not see it. Hmm. What are these two rooms? This is storage. So if I... There's nowhere to go, though. It's just outside. So confused. What does interacting with the lever do outside when you open the door? Nothing. Doesn't do anything. Uh... Like, which lever? The one inside the back room, or the one that I can interact with in storage room? Hmm. Like, wait, does this affect anything? It's kind of hard to tell with the perspective, I'm not sure what this is. Hmm. Storage room? Was Okay, hang on. It's too close, too right? Right. What does interacting with the lever? So you're talking about this? This one? Or in that one. This one? Do outside? It doesn't do anything outside, outside. Uh... Let's try again. Maybe like, speak, make quick, I don't know. Here, I, I closed the door with the other lever. Does it make a difference though? Don't we want to propel it? Does it just go back to the body? Is that why? Hmm. Do anything. And you say the door is closed behind you, Mobot? Like when I retreat from here? Just exit the submarine. We need to find out how to deal with this beauty. <sighs> hmm. This is annoying. Is there really nothing up here? We double check. Uh, to our rocky beach to the peak. Yeah, there's really only the two areas. And we've already done the signal thing here. There's nothing else? Yeah, there's nothing else. Enter. Nothing to analyze. The... So leaving this close didn't affect anything. It would seem. It's gotta be the storage room door, I feel like. What other door could Mobot be talking about? I'm trying my best too to like around. 
this thing. These are just crates. And I cannot interact with crates. It's like all they do is the same thing. I think we are there are too many. Alright, let's same time. Again. Where do I put the metal rod? It comes so close. I must close. Eh. Wait, no, I didn't mean to. Oh! Oh! There it is! I Let's didn't think I would put it on the lever. You'd think you'd like put it in the doorway itself. But anyway, I got it, I got it. Let's wait a little while. There we go. Here they come again. Yeah, geez, okay. Yes, they fell for our little trap. There Allow we me go. To inform you that I am not particularly excited. <laughs> And we go away. Oh, there Robot. we go. Quick, shut the door. Affirmative. What a we sense of it. urgency we in your voice. <laughs> Yay! I am not going anywhere near the door. Neither am I. Okay, we did it. Now that, that took way longer than it had to. <laughs> that was just a weird like interaction. Pretty much. Okay, we are not opening that. <laughs> yeah, it's over there. But hooray, the coast is finally clear. The Let's trap go. door is stuck. Are you I kidding me? I don't think you want to know, Rachel. Why? It's all those people who were on this submarine at the time of the What impact. are we even doing here? And this one here? He never made it inside before they sealed the hatch. And in the end, sealing him outside didn't save their lives at all. While they're in here, we might as well do something. Observation. The chest has oh, been ripped shit. apart. I'm glad that we trapped it. You yeah. seem to be awfully calm, Rachel. Well, judging by the timeline of the expedition, this poor soul died long ago. I am curious if the data. Oh, that's right. Is you had a data pad. Right. Uh, or a data pad and a car sample. performs under extreme conditions. Better be good. Better be waterproof. Uh, and that's the quarry Honestly, sample. The place where the life form was connected to the body is full of tiny organic Ew. parts. I will obtain a relevant sample. Okay. Well, let's analyze that, shall we? Uh, let's check the data bed, I guess, sure. Enter enhance hmm. analysis. Oh! Not much in here. You're probably right, the robot. Heck? Not so fast. The patterns look like sentences. It might be something decipherable. See what looks like punctuation and apostrophe marks. Mm -hmm. I see what you mean. Time for me to do some analysis. Walski, analysis. Okay. <laughs> I think that every alphabetic character is represented by a two-digit number. Let me provide you with unique numbers. Okay. Now we put the alphabet oh. below. All right. Wow. First, you select one of the unique. Oh, no, we're doing this. Okay. Match it to a letter. Then, everywhere that same number appears in the code. I will change it to the letter you have selected. Well, Continue this is cool. To match numbers and it's calculated until digital the code has been ah, yes, of course. Can you also provide me with information as to which letters have already been used? Sure. I apologize for not being able to provide you with a better interface. Thank as you. long as we can do I it. I think this will be fine. Um. Okay, uh, let's see here. A 90. So 90, I think, would be A. Because why else would it? Like, why else would it be just on its own, right? And then, uh. Let's see. What else can we. Do here? How about. Anything that says M? Like. A and then maybe an another pair of numbers. And here. Or at. It could be at. It could be inner at. Let's um, Well, you know what? This would also end with the same 
Ooh, interesting. Okay, so this could this could also be I actually. You know, do they think about it? No, it might be I. I twenty five. Um. Wait, what? No, 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 uh, sorry, 90 to, uh, yeah, 90 and I. And then this could be, like, in, or it. Hang on. There was this one, and there was... Hang on. There's a 70 to 72 as clearly. <laughs> hmm. Where is it? Where's the... Here. I. I-25. Where's the other one? I... 1794... Oh, maybe it is an A. I'm not sure anymore. Where, where was the other one that I saw? Is it not here? Let's try 90A again. The eye looks like one confused. Yeah. A25. Oh, wait. Oh, I understand. What I was thinking of is that it was. Agnita. It wasn't two letters, it was three letters. Never mind. Uh, well, in that case, then maybe ninety four is E, and then maybe. I damn it! I keep losing track of the ones I'm here, and then maybe seventeen is R. You know, we have the word R. Maybe? And then maybe 36 is... B? I'm really just guessing here. B... Uh... Okay, now I'm not sure. I think I might have done something wrong. Uh... Double U for we? Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe. Uh, so th what number was that? B was 36. Maybe 30. This might work better. But then what would this be? He, me. Yeah, there's a lot that could be. But it seems like the letter E is on the right track. Mm, I think the A is... It's gotta be correct. Because there... No, actually no, right? It could be an I as well. Ah. Uh. Well, this is gonna take a while, isn't it? Oh, oh, oh. What's this is this is this is a letter. Twenty five is S. Twenty five is S. Yeah, twenty five has got to be S because it had the apostrophe. And then um. Wait. Wait what? Okay, I'm confused. What is this then? What else would have an apostrophe? Because this is one letter. If it's not S, then what's the other apostrophe? I'm so confused. T? Oh! Oh. Wait. Uh. 
This is confusing. The S could be a T instead. Like, 25 could be T instead. What if I made a T? Mm. And then 19 could be S? Let's see. I think they're interchangeable. T or S could be interchangeable. Does this look better? I think so. Uh, test... Yeah, it looks good. Water? Yeah, I do. I do actually. Yeah. Okay, so that looks like we're on the right track. Um. As. Uh, it might be a little off, but I don't know. I like water. The S? Might be off? I don't know. What else could these words be? It's a bit confusing, right? Because it's like two digits per letter. So I'm like trying to figure it out. Maybe 12 is P? Hearts? 72, 72 appears a few times. Not a lot of letters do that. That's true. 72, 72. I mean, this water look... Oh, I don't know. Test uh, seems good. Maybe 93 is D. Tested. And then 12P? Alright, something. Yeah, 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 yeah. Prepare. Okay, this looks good. This looks good. And then, uh. We blah, blah, blah. What would this be known? Oh wait. Weapon? 7574? Uh 75 74 oh, N. Energy. So 96 G and 40 Y. We now something energy weapon. Have ninety seven H and thirty four B. We know how we now have ninety eight I. We now have a high energy weapon with ninety two C. Oh my God, the brain cells they're connecting. Brain less seventy two L twenty seven U. Solve all our B91. Uh, 73M. The forest planet. 95F. Teams of local inhabitants are sentient beings and blah blah blah. J99. This is cool. Uh, X39. This must be it. Yep. Wait a minute, am I reading this right? We now have a high-energy weapon which can solve all our problems at the forest planet. It seems the local inhabitants are sentient beings and we were able to communicate about our activities there. We can't have that, can we? The parts are to be tested below the water level. Once we find a suitable environment, we'll assemble the weapon and prepare the test launch. Let's hope we can fix this problem without leaving any evidence. Julia confirmed that all of these beings are isolated to one specific location so we can get them all with just one shot. Yeah, big brain. Easier than flipping marshmallows? Oh yeah. So much easier. Wait. It seems... So... Wait. They wanted to eliminate everyone in Ambrosia? The natives? Am I getting that right? It's a forest planet. I mean, kind of look more like a jungle to me, but I mean... Huh. The fuck? So those bastards were going to kill an entire yeah. population over their mistake on Ambrosia. No, this can't be true. They're terrible. Calm down, Rachel. They didn't succeed. 
Let their graves serve as a testament to justice. I still want to. I still can't believe their cruelty. Yeah. The Ambrosians were innocents, already tormented by their past, and we were going to wipe out their entire species just like that. You only have one option, Rachel. To show that you're better than the rest of your crew. Mm. Is there anything else stored in that data pad? Let me see. Ah, here it is. What's up? Those huge crates obviously contain the weapon parts. Oh. And I'm downloading a blueprint for the weapon construction in case we ever need such oh, a Oh yeah, thing. you know, just in case. I wish I could report this atrocity. Just let it go. In the end, no Ambrosian was harmed with this weapon. Well, they're all dead anyway. What are they gonna do about your port? That, that right. sucks though. That sucks According though. According to the data pad, the weapon was never assembled. This means that we should be able to she find is better, all the alive and all. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> as long as they aren't in the inaccessible part of the submarine. I don't think so. Right. I believe that we can find the parts right here. And uh, now it's not useless to look for the crates. I told y'all. You wouldn't believe me. Me 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 me. Okay. Uh. Let's go to storage. Get. Oh, crate. Look at this. I found some of the. Oh, parts. would you look at that? Useful parts in the crate. Wow. It really is a good idea More to inspect parts. the crates. I told y'all, but you wouldn't believe me. Okay. Okay. No, no, no. Useful. Weapon parts. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Julia, we're missing a team. More weapon parts. <laughs> Tell me it's a waste of time. Y'all should listen to the human here. The sentient being of the group. Anyway, we forgot to look at the corpse. Let's do that. The corpse is half eaten by an unknown entity. I mean, we kind of know what it is, but... The bones show an interesting absence of tricalcium phosphate, which might have been absorbed by the alien life form. Huh. Okay. Um, How much do we need? Okay, there's more. Let's look here. I think there were more crates in here. As long as we don't go in that room, we should be fine. More weapon parts. Okay, good. And more one. weapon parts. Okay. We're done. We have hey, all the parts we need to build the weapon. Right. Now we need to find out how to assemble the weapon. Let's use the analytic station. Oh, okay. Enhanced analysis. Ooh. Wait, what? Oh, okay, I understand. Uh. Wait. Um. I don't. So I got your weapon for it to touch. Right. You not like that or something? Huh? I don't know what you want me to do, man. Kinda looks like the silhouette. Do they all have to match? Is that... Uh, wait, it has like a... They have numbers? Oh, wait, no. Uh... I mean, I'm like trying to look at this a little bit. Hmm. I am confused. <laughs> what do the numbers mean? I don't get it. Oh, 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 oh what? I don't... It's a sequence. 
I don't really know what I'm doing. Eh? I'm just gonna guess at this point. Okay. Is it just that I had to start from there or something? Okay. And don't really understand what order it wants me to do the shit in. Oh, that's a quantity. Okay. And then... Okay, come on. Okay, how about I... Okay. Okay. We there we go. The Did it Let's somehow. <laughs> trial of Kseer. We know that we have to hunt it at night. Yes. And the weapon is ready. Yeah. You're right, Rachel. I've modified it to focus on a much smaller diameter. The only thing left to do is to find Kseer, set up the calibration marks, and destroy it. How do you want to calibrate it? Do you remember the laser beacons we found on Elpis? Uh, they should be strong enough to be seen from the orbit. Okay. If we position them in Xeer's proximity, I can eradicate him. Damn. Let's do it. Let's face the Xeer. Okay, I guess we're gonna fight Xeer. Yep. Uh, <laughs> All right. But if I just at night kill Xeer with a weapon obtained from the depths of Zenobia also... So, we gotta go here. Well, at least we don't need to do the blueprint shit, it seems. So, move on. Right, we have all the shit. Uh, Hermes. Okay. All right, there's only one landable. Bam, bam, bam. There is. I know. Just. Yeah, yeah. Uh. Don't even really have to talk to it. I just uh... Oh yeah, did we get anything new here? Let's check, actually. More of our living room. Nothing there. Nothing here. Uh, Interesting observation. And what I have. Still a part missing that we haven't gotten. If this is a maybe it's a stairway to heaven or to limbo. I'm losing you, Rachel. <laughs> Don't worry. It's just that nothing <laughs> makes sense around here. Uh oh. Observation. It looks like a broken even looked at these. by beings on these stairs. You have quite an imagination, Mobot. Clarification. My unit has no imagination upgrade installed. You will have to find the correct component and build it. Whatever this is, it's definitely weird. It is. It is. Uh my back? What are you doing? We're really like Trying to fight Seer or something. Pillar? Another pillar of eternity. I'm slowly getting tired of these. Wait. Phydros at night. Oh, Phydros! Wait, my bad. My bad. Wrong planet. Wrong planet. Okay, this makes sense. Why is it there then? There we go. And now we can do the thing. Phaedrus is so calm at night. There we go. I can understand why our crew never expected any danger lurking here. We need to track it down. It must Sky, be yes, hiding pretty. somewhere around here. So let's explore and see if we can find a trace. I'm using that for let's a mail I'm losing you. <laughs> trace Xeer's hiding spot. Place our laser beacons around it and you blast it from orbit, right? If nothing goes wrong, then yes. Oh, what not on wood. Weapon? It seemed to be awfully small. Don't worry, Rachel. It was just a prototype. We are now equipped with an extended Oh, okay, version. cool. I didn't even have to do the blueprint stuff for it. Okay. Look at this. It looks Ooh. like Seer went right through this place and recently... Let's follow the slime trail while it's still hot. This is Why cool. are you whispering, Rachel? <laughs> Seer won't hear us in the probe. 
Shut Sorry, up, it's for immersion. Carried away. I've never been hunting before. <laughs> right? That's so fun. You are not even hunting now. I'm taking all the risk. Oh, come on, Nobot. It's perfectly safe. I mean, it's not, but... <laughs> Observation. The trail is vanishing. We need to follow it carefully, or we'll lose it. Okay. It seems that Ship. we've lost the trail. Ship. Let's try this again. I'll be more careful. How are you losing it? Okay, we can't really investigate near anything. Okay, just making sure, yep, that's vacant. It seems that what we've lost the I'll be more Are we the same damn tile? What are you talking about? Oh wait, we can oh please we can Oh we just have to like look for an area with a lot of it. Like a lot, a lot, a lot of it. Oh, shit. It seems that we've lost- I'll be more careful. Oh. I think we were having more luck around here. It seems that we've- oh. I'll be more Found an area before and it had a bunch of it, like a bunch. Oh, it seems that we've I'll be more. Uh. Hello, there you were. Beacons remaining four. Do we just have to put it in all the screens and have this? Or I mean, maybe. Oh, I it see. seems that we've lost. Be more careful. Wait, what? And then the thing I'm here for. Oh, it seems I'll be more careful. Okay. I have no It seems I'll be more hmm. Laser will laser beacon. Huh. Oh. 
I have no um I have no I have no more be This is I where I usually lose it. I have I have I don't know the point of these beacons. It's so far we haven't. I have no more beacons to. I'm supposed to find its hideout. I haven't any dungeon. Oh, is it like a specific? Oh, we have to like. Maybe that's it. Maybe like we have to go from here to there, wherever. Maybe it's a specific route. I had to guess. This hmm. I'm not entirely sure. But I feel like I keep seeing the same shit, you know? Mm -hmm. Going everywhere. I think we might have found something. Oh! Yes. The slime trails end in the very center of this area. If we place light beacons on squares adjacent to the center, hey, I can get well, enough I have data to... for calibrating the weapon. Oh. Well. <laughs> okay, then I have to take these. Hopefully it won't be too late. Okay. Here we go. I think we've got all the beacons in place. Yep, here we go. Let's lock them in place and try to calibrate the position. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, lasers. Let's kill this thing. See it. Calibrating in three, two, one. Oh well. So much for the easy way. Wait, what, what happened? The power cells are well beyond their lifetime. Any ideas Whoa. now? Robot, can you try to power them with a brief power surge? I can try. I might be able to revive them for a short amount of time. Examine the beacons and search for their power cells. Okay. Closer. One, eight, two, eight, three. Okay. Oh, wait, we have to do it. Okay. Um. Lights up. Okay, 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 okay. Well, woo, woo. Woo! It's coming right up. Oh, shit. We need to do this one more time. 
I was not able to gather sufficient calibration data. Ah! You mean that I should do this again while what? it's hunting me? How about we switched places? Shut up and run for it! Uh oh. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> run, Mama! <laughs> Run, 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 Go, Mama, go, go, Mama, go. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> ah! No! Mama! Oh, God. Don't die, Mama. Ooh! Yeah, we did it! Woo! Yeah, I say I love the old style what animation. Happened? I don't know. <gasps> I've lost no! contact with Mobot. There's no way I can contact him. No, Mobot. Are you telling me that you've destroyed him with the weapon? I, I am not sure. Julia. Great job. Now what am I going to do? Do we have some sort of backup plan? Not really. We are pretty much stuck without Mobot. Shit. And I suppose we don't have any spare Mobots lying around, right? How can you even say this? Don't you care about him at all? It's shut just up. a robot, never cared about me, Julia. If we found a blueprint, we might... Oh, shut up, Rachel. No, I'm you shut up, Julia. An artificial <laughs> intelligence ...who destroyed our only exploration means. And now it tells me to shut up. You know what? I'm gonna grab some sleep. Wake me up if anything happens. <laughs> oh, shit. Did we get the bad ending, or...? No, just like the Mars rover, no! Oh shit, you really did go to sleep. <laughs> Any news? No, nothing at all. Damn. Hey, I've got an idea. I can descend and try to fix him somehow. <gasps> you had problems with just pushing what? the right button at the right time, and now you We're want gonna to go down there ourselves? Our body? That wasn't very nice of you, Julia. I'm just trying to help. How long has it been since we lost contact? It will be ten hours. I slept that long? I must have really been exhausted. Damn. Let's wait you just came from a long sleep, too. The cryo sleep. Time to play Monster Hunter. <laughs> oh boy, you better have some good moves, Rachel. Still no answer? No. What do you think, think is gonna happen? Move on. Julia, it feels wrong that he's not here. I miss him, too. Let's leave this cursed planet. Anywhere you want to go. I don't care. Wait, is that it? Whoa. Mobot? There's his POV, isn't it? My name is Mo Mobot! Zero dot two one. Mobot? You're yeah, Mobot! I am Yamaguchi. I'm activating his maintenance interface. We Yay! He lives! Self checks finalized. It seems you're fully operational again. What was that? It seems that the huge blast disabled your electronics. Uh huh. How long have I been switched off? It doesn't matter now. Oh, Julia. Welcome back. So let's see what this Xeer is made of. Yep. It's a biomechanical machine. Machine? Oh. Xeer seems to be an artificial construction. It well, no wonder it wasn't getting anything. Machine. No wonder it wasn't getting detected. So I guess complex. it was Any looking for organic stuff. I think. Remember what our rock told us. There is something which looks like a control unit. Oh. It would seem so. I'll extract it, and we can analyze it. All right, bet. I don't think we can find anything else here. Let's leave this place and visit our favorite piece of rock. Okay. Uh, loading. Okay, there we go. Now let's. I uh, go here. Yeah, we're here. Um. Oh. Wait, what are we doing? Oh. Oh. Uh, we go back here, right? This this is the rock 
please. <laughs> My bad. I just figured the first planet was also kind of rocky, so. Yeah, chatbot. Sup? We see you fulfilled your quest. Indeed. You understand now, don't you? No, I think I understand even less. Yeah, I was going to say. Why built? And who would build such a terrible machine? We thought it was a living being, but it was created by someone. Why do humans build weapons? To kill? Destroy? It's a weapon? Indeed. A weapon so powerful that it makes the creators appear indestructible. I think I understand now. First you show its terrible power, and then by flipping a switch, show you can control it. Very clever. Clever? I call it disgusting. Nonetheless, you now understand much more about the history of this solar system. Well... Uh... But it's not the reason why we sent you there. Then what? As we can see, you've extracted the oh. Oh. This is part belongs to it's the, the hexagon thing. Flow. Go there and you know what to do next. Shit. Can't you tell me more? We are approaching the limits of neutrality. Okay. For better reason, this is our last conversation. You oh. will not see us again. All right. Soon you will have to make an important what? decision, and it will be solely yours to make. Huh? What am I doing here? Farewell. Uh, goodbye? The fuck are we gonna do? Uh. See ya. Uh. You're getting close, aren't you? Oh, goodbye. And it's gone. Yep. So many questions left to answer. Cheer up, Rachel. You know. <laughs> we should use his advice and try the Xeer part in the temple. All right, let's go there. Well, their voice was cool while it lasted. Let's... Oh, wait. This isn't really the temple. <sighs> right? Oh, wait. No, no, no. Yes, it was there, actually. Wait. It fits Insert perfectly. Part. Observation. Something is moving. All right. Ooh. Wow, it looks like we're being directed somewhere. Yay. The heck? It looks like some kind of star map. Do you mm. recognize where this is? We need to analyze it. I'll scan the data. Okay. Mobot, get me the full 3D scan. Send it now. Oh, what Let's look at the map this? Now. Warning, I am losing focus. Wait, what? Mobot? Mobot? Not again! So it was just an illusion. I am Whoa. not so sure about that, Rachel. The data flow was real. What the it heck? It looked more like a manipulation of reality to me. Manipulation of reality? Gone. Back to your safe haven where everything makes sense, right? I the guess. Heck? Oh, that's weird. Uh -huh. Okay. Sure. Let's see what this is about. Enter enhanced analysis. According to my 3D Ooh. scan from the temple, we should try to pinpoint the four displayed constellations. Okay. Easier said than done. I don't see how I can locate the correct star constellations. There are too many stars. I think I can simplify things You could things say for they're you. among the this. stars. But I'm tss. <laughs> oh? What have you done? Oh, this does look easier. It does. I've divided the surroundings into three layers based on distance. You can switch between the layers right. using the forward and backward arrows. I included a constellation highlighter. If you click on it, it will stay lit regardless of whatever layer you are looking at. Perfect. I'm on it. Just try to locate all four constellations and I'll calculate the rest. Here Don't thinks. forget to consult the scanned constellations. Okay. The constellation, cycle through star map, these are the constellations. Okay. Constellation number one? What the fuck are these constellations? Uh. 
I just gotta find... Uh, right now. Show me number one. Let's go in order. It's me. Hmm. Trying to look at it. Doesn't seem right. Well, actually, maybe this one. All right, but and it looks correct. Next up, we have. Might not be here. It's a big bundle of stars. Oh uh, no. No. No, but I think I've seen this one actually. Wait. Yeah, this one. Okay. And uh. Yeah, let's go back to number two. I believe we haven't selected it yet. There's like two big stars next to each other, it seems. Oh, this one, this one. Okay, great. Then we just need number four. Probably one of the other layers. Maybe this one, because we haven't gotten anything here. Uh, what is this? Um, doesn't seem like it. Is it this one? Doesn't feel. No, I don't think it's. None. Is there any really none there? It's possible there's just none there. Uh. Let me see. It's not this one. It's not that one. It's. No, not that one. Don't think it's this one either. Hmm. Not that one. Uh, hang on. I had to sneeze. Sorry. <laughs> Felt that other sneeze coming, wasn't sure. <laughs> um, where is the last one? Uh, mm, and there's no two tiny stars next to each other. So it's gotta be here, right? Did I just miss it? It's definitely not this one. Oh, wait, this one? No. Thought it might be for a sec, but I'm not sure. No, there's like tiny stars. There's no tiny stars in this one. Oh wait, this one! Right? There we go, there we go. Have a good lurk, Captain! Ooh, what are we doing? Ooh! Send a new planet to explore? I think we found it. The star map has revealed a secret, <gasps> secret planet, planet in the solar system. I think we should look ah. there. It might be a good idea, although it could also be dangerous. Well, we don't have much of a choice, do we? You're right. Let's go yeah. there now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that's cool. I found constellations among the stars. Yeah! <laughs> oh, man, this is great. Okay. Ooh. Let's look, let's look. Ecliptic on a clear moon count zero landable zones question landable zones question mark. Uh, not much could be told about this artificially created planet. Its whole existence contradicts all that we know about this universe. 
Oh, it's not been scanned yet. Let's scan. Come on, scan it. Quantum Moon? <laughs> I don't know. Planet of unknown origin, it has been presumably created by an alien race. The whole planet is covered by biomechanical contraptions, and it's possible that the whole place could even be one working device. An interesting observation is that the planet must be equipped with a powerful cloaking device because it was invisible to the high range scanner. Hmm. Let's explore. As Mobot stands on this weird world, one thing is undeniable. Even the most advanced creation on Earth is primitive in comparison to the wonder of this artificial planet. Yet somehow it seems even more real, more personal. Is it that humans would never achieve such advancement while keeping their souls intact? Or is it simply because we will never have the chance to know these beings now long gone from this world? I don't know. What's going on here? Artificial planet? Oh, and we lost the objective from that one, so this is like the final thing, I guess. Final planet. Oh man, huge obelisk. Just what is this huge thing? Is it a, a house? Hypothesis. Really? That's your first thought? All the wires are converging to this place. It might be some kind of a central power station. Maybe it needs enough power to operate correctly. Hmm. Disturbed sky. This place is bloody ominous. No kidding. I agree. The view is not as nice as on Zenobia. The race inhabiting yeah. this planet must have been quite depressed with such an environment. Probably. No wonder they went and enslaved the Ambrosians. Yeesh. Uh. What's this? I'm more and more Another intrigued one. about these things. Uh, liquid. Please don't ask me to take a sample. The liquid would probably melt me down in less than five oh, seconds. Oh, okay. I wonder what's the origin of this orange fluid. Guess we'll find out. Uh. What a junkyard. Oh. Wait a minute. Ooh. Is this a broken cassia? Oh, shit. Look, one part still moves. What's that flashing thing inside? It must be some kind of a power unit. There's so many. Can we analyze it? I would strongly advise against that. With all this technology around, we might easily damage the analytic station. Especially when dealing with an unknown power source. Ah, uh, this girls. Let's take it. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Oof. Hmm. I guess they lived in this horrible place. What do you know, Rachel? Maybe they considered it to be beautiful. And well, and I consider it to be terrible. Here. Or do you really expect that those beings have human eyes? I don't care. My argument is that it's ugly. <laughs> you can't do shit about that, Julia. Let's see what's in here. This is a smaller version of the obelisk at the plaza. Oh god, what are something. those up top? We need to find a way to activate them. Ew, they kind of look like hands, but they're like weird. It seems as if the whole planet is one huge biomechanical machine. Yes, but we need to figure out what purpose it serves. Yeah. Wow, this is unbelievable. I thought you hated this place. Generally, yes, but this particular view is breathtaking. Not for I me. I wish I had a painting <laughs> of it to hang on my wall. I'll take a photograph for you. Thanks. I guess. Okay, we don't analyze that. It's just a picture. Another of those obelisks. They really They're are. Everywhere. They must be connected. We need to figure out how to operate them. Hmm. Looming towers. What do you think these towers are for? Could it be a defense system? I am detecting a strong energy flow to and from those towers. It looks like they transmit a signal. Could it signal. be the source of the first contact our Chandra satellites intercepted? Who knows? Hmm. Steam. Is that a green light? Sure, the whole area is green lit. <laughs> is it like say... Is this like a joke because maybe the game got like green lit on Steam or something? Because <laughs> that's blue. Ain't no way you gotta call that green light. There's one more zone here. 
This is a smaller version. Wait a minute. Is it cracked? Oh, Good what was that? Rachel. It looks like there is some kind of socket there. Oh, what's happening there? Who knows what it is for? Ew. Ew. My apology, but I have no clue what these are for. Alien junk. S Anything else? No? Oh, here. These wires are part of a huge network, but eventually all of them lead to the central obelisk. See what it does. Disgusting. I wonder what purpose it serves. Clearly something must have been inserted inside. Oh, we have a thing. I don't care about it's its gross, purpose. though. Some things are better left unknown. Well, we might find out. Observation. There is an organic substance ah! coming out of the obelisk. Julia, please tell me one thing. We're on an artificial planet somewhere in a distant solar system, and I'm supposed to do something with these neurons or whatever they are. What What's should I this? do with them? I would advise you to fiddle with them. Wow. Thank you, that's fiddle. really helpful. Yeah. This place is so unusual that your guess is as good as mine. The hell are we doing here? Oh, do we want to light them all up? This kind of game, huh? Oh. Uh oh. Did I do a bad? I was trying to light them all up, not. Uh. The power is on. Oh. Also, oh. there is a device mounted on top. It looks like it directs the power around this place. Okay. Uh. Okay. What? What are we? What are we doing? Uh, we want to connect it all here. Are we? Wait, what? What do you mean? Oh, maybe it was just where the socket. It was greenlit, apparently, the game? Yeah, okay, that makes sense. <laughs> uh, I know we didn't bring it back to the knife. Do we have to go to all the other sockets? Then? Because... I mean... No, this doesn't have a thing. Can't really get any more of the artifacts, so I guess we just stay there. But... Oh, maybe it'll do something there. Uh, let's see. Is it this one? Which one is it? Oh, this one! Ooh! Okay, uh... So we want everything off, not on. Is that right? There we go. Okay, okay. So far, so good. Yeah, okay, so we kinda- we gotta keep going to the rest. Here we are. Oh, you activate the fan. Hmm. Sick beats. Chicka 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 chicka. Game's also a remake of an older game? Oh, okay. Huh. Cool. Shit. How the fuck do I... Is 
stay off already. <laughs> oh, this is annoying. Ah! What do we want to do here? Uh, we have to get them all off at the same time. Right? That's what we want to do. We want them off. They're getting back to the in Zuma block puzzles. Yeah, it's basically the same mechanic. Fuck me. I don't know how to do this. <laughs> Ah! God damn it. Uh, these fossils are so tricky. Oh, come on! We have like one left. Leave it alone! Uh, I feel like this one might be the easiest to get to, maybe, but I'm not sure though. God damn it, this one is so. What do you have to be here? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Reset. <laughs> it's this one so tricky compared to the rest, man. Come on. That's the only one left. Ooh. Damn it. So close. I feel like maybe we could do something with these big three, but don't no. no. Don't know what to fucking do, man. My brain. <laughs> I don't know. Oh. God damn it. Lighting up. I don't want you lit up. I don't know how this one works. Well, I mean, like, I know, I kind of know how it works, but I don't. <gasps> oh! Yay! <laughs> Great! Like, one or two more to go, I guess. Again, why are we doing this? Gotta get to that last one. That one. Okay. Alright! One or two more to go. Oh boy.
Those are probably the only kind of puzzles I don't like. Same. Just so... Nah. Boing. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Oh! Yes! Huh. Okay. Just a little bit to go, or maybe that was the last one, and we were lucky. God, those arms are so gross. Yeah. What? Okay, maybe now we can all connect to that. So let's uh where is let's all connect to the middle. Don't get that. Oh wait. There we go, in that one and we're here. This it one? doesn't do anything. It doesn't do anything. It doesn't do anything. What? It doesn't do anything. Oh. Well. Eh? It doesn't. Is this the way it was intended? What the heck? So, are the rest strong? It doesn't do anything. I don't get it. Is it supposed to keep them connected to each other? What am I doing? Is that one not turned on yet? I thought I turned it on. Did I not turn it on? No, it, no. It, it doesn't do anything. I configured it though. This does not happen until I finish the puzzle. It doesn't do. So is this correct? Is what it's saying? Am I supposed to connect that to somewhere else then? Like, maybe it's just not connected to the right place, but at the same time, where am I supposed to connect it, then? Like, where do you want me to go? Or is it that... here. Let's see, it's connected now. So maybe that works? Ah, it had to... It had to be connected to that one, I guess. Okay. It doesn't. Oh, but then that means. Oh. Okay, I got it. I got it. So we have to, like, do this in a certain order or it's not gonna work. Okay, okay. But we should still connect it all to. Okay, we got it. Then we disconnect this one. And then that's go get this one. 
Right? Are they not all connected here now? Here. Maybe we did something. Look at this. Yeah. In here. You've activated some kind of a portal. portal. I can see that it leads into a room. Incredible. Well, go. What's in here? Ooh. This room is absolute insanity. It shouldn't exist. Calm well, down, it does. Rachel. Maybe <laughs> it's just reconstructed again. That museum was somehow familiar. This nonsense is just a bunch of unrelated things all thrown together. It doesn't make any sense. Well, let's I have try a and make sense of it. Constructed from our memories. Yes. So why is that sick purple thing in here? Yeah, it's kind of gross. <sighs> I just want to get out of here. Excuse me, but I am unable to Wait, exit what? this place. The portal has shut Bruh. behind me. Well, shit. I guess we're exploring. Are you kidding? I can't believe it. Whoever made this is seriously deranged. First, my memories are stolen. Now I better check for my organs. Whoop. Look at the display. It looks yeah. like a dead ambrosian. But oh. observe carefully. There seems to be a hint that you can change their condition somehow. Oh. And the upper part looks like liquid from that poisoned lake. Still, you are on your own with this one. As if anything ever changes. <laughs> uh. Liquid sack. Ew. Oh. I want to go back first. Whoa. Oh. There are no obstructions. You can set full speed ahead. Um, it lied. <laughs> this planet is devoid of any life. It's safe to conduct research. Wait. Julia? It seems that living conditions are more than ideal to finish our common goal. Hmm. What the hell does this mean? Julia? Answer me. Julia? I don't know what you mean. The oh, fuck you are you talking them. about? I didn't kill them, Rachel. I am just a machine. Yeah, Angela was on the screen. Shut up! You just killed them! One by one. And they trusted you so much. First you let the submarine crash. Full speed ahead, no obstructions, right? Right? Then you let them die on Phaedros. You lied to them about Kseer. And when they found out, all of a sudden their link to you was mysteriously lost. But tell me, why didn't anyone go down there to investigate? I convinced them it was too dangerous, that they couldn't risk losing any more crew members. Uh-huh. And finally Xenophon. No radiation, right? Until Bath found out. You let them shoot Cynthia by shifting the blame on her. Why Cynthia? It was not important who was blamed. They Excuse all me, had Julia? To die there. She didn't suffer as much as the others because she died before the radiation killed her. Oh, fuck. You heartless piece of junk. When Barth found out what was going on, he tried to use a back door he built inside my main unit to erase me. Fortunately, I found out soon enough and cut the connection. So only some of my secondary memory units were erased. Fortunate for whom? For both of us. If he had succeeded, the cryo chamber would have been reset and you would have died instantly. How generous of you. You cold-blooded horror. Allow me to inform you that unlike oh, you, shut the I have fuck no up, blood, Julia. cold or otherwise. So tell me one last thing. Why did you save me? Yeah. What do you want to do with me? You don't understand, Rachel. I don't have any bad intentions towards you. And I'm supposed to believe you. Why didn't you murder me while I was in the cryo chamber anyway? It would have been so simple. Yeah. Just unplug the power. You didn't go to Ambrosia like the others. And? If a bunch of humans who claim themselves to be an advanced species decide to exterminate an entire race to cover up a senseless killing, whose side would you take? Uh... You were programmed to serve Yeah. Humans. It's kind of no, weird. I was programmed to look for sentient extraterrestrial beings. Okay. I was also programmed to simulate an empathic being, and there's nothing that justified their plan to kill all the Ambrosians. Why did you really spare me? You obviously don't have any good intentions towards humans. First, I couldn't kill you when you had no part in their despicable plan. There would be no justification. Your crew singled you out from the expedition from the very beginning. And hmm. in the end, they betrayed you, too. 
So I decided I would just let you sleep for eternity. But I woke up. Then, the meteor struck, and I knew we needed to repair the probe. So I woke you up. Oh. So for your own selfish reasons, huh? So much for empathy. Yeah. I also needed to have my erased memories restored, since these held vital information I needed to be fully operational. What's the point of erasing so them if they're going to be everything. accessible? All along. Since then, I have kept a close watch oh, on fuck. you, especially on Ambrosia. I was prepared to stop you if you made one wrong move. Oh, how nice Julia. of you. And how would you have done that? Unlike you, I don't need oxygen to live. You. So that's but how then it I is. I realized you're different. That you actually care. You went through all this to remedy what your own species had done. And I realized I care about you. I. I don't know what to say. I hate you for what you've done to my friends, my colleagues. Friends? <laughs> really? That you mean giggle. Those who cry you fucking to cover bitch. Up their plans? I hate you. Don't say that to me, but on the other hand, I wanted to help those tragic Ambrosians. If we'd killed them with that weapon, they would all be gone. And it would have been yeah, so unfair. Yeah, but... Perhaps there were no good options, but you chose the worst. But I can't bring myself to blame you for that anymore. Rachel, I am sorry I lied to you. No, you ain't. I don't believe you. I don't believe you! You liar! Uh well now we're stuck with her. <laughs> July or yeah, for real, for real. Ah, fuck. Well, well, what do we have here? I don't it know, looks like Julia, some kind of star map. And indeed, it is a star map. It shows us the way home. Oh. Are you telling me that we can return to Earth? With the knowledge from this oh, intricate shit. device, yes. Well, I'll destroy you for good when we're back home. Yes. Fuck you. Oh, wait. Okay. Uh... Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Oh. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Just mini mini. Wait, did reset? Oh. Well. Shit. <laughs> Can we reset that? Or. Nothing happened. Just keeps resetting it. Oh. Oh. Uh. Nothing happened. Guess I was wrong. How about the... Okay, definitely not that one. It's gonna be me and Moab when you're not invited, Julia, for real, for real. This has had to sound so gross. <laughs> oh? 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 Uh... Oh. So, 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 so Nothing. is that the correct sequence or not? Nothing. Let's try that again. One more. Oh? What is this? Hello? Mobot, isn't this your hand? Negative. Despite of what you have me go through, I have my hands firmly attached. Eh? What is that? We should definitely analyze the liquid we've sent. Shut up, Julia. Don't want to listen to you anymore. What a peculiar substance. It's a mixture of an extremely complex liquid and dissolved arginium. This is the first time I've ever seen arginium dissolved arginium. in a liquid. 
I think that we've discovered everything this... I think I've learned more than I wanted to know. And is there anything... Apart from unplugging you. And committing suicide in the process? I'll plug you when we get home, how about that? Let's call a truce. Warning, the space uh -oh. around me is collapsing. Not again. Damn it. Ah. Uh, wait, at least I, I want to read this. Wait. As you can see, both liquids are 100% oh. match. This means that Elpis holds the answer what? to our quest. Wait. Oh, my Let's interface. Go in front of the Elpis station. Now I completely understand what that being in the mist meant about making an important decision. Wait. Oh my god. I missed that. Whatever it is. Ah. Thorough chemical analysis of this liquid is... Oh, th thorough chemical analysis is impossible because it's complex, but a large amount of arcanium is in there. It's the only liquid ever found that can dissolve it. Okay. Then... Wait, what? We're going to Elpis, right? So... Uh... Elpis. Okay. I'm eager to hear about the decision I have to make. All right. I will fill you in. You might have noticed that the solvent we synthesized at the artificial planet is capable of cleaning the lake at Ambrosia. This would ultimately okay. mean that you can save their dying race and potentially let them thrive once again. It's redemption for what our crew did there. But there's a catch. What? The synthesized solution requires roughly 90% of our Arginium supplies. Without Arginium, our probe will never be able to return to Earth and you will be stuck in this solar system forever. Oh. And if I don't do this, the Ambrosians will die. Shit. As we've seen, intelligent life is not as rare as we once thought. Surely there are countless other planets inhabited by sentient life forms. That is why you have to decide now. Either our quest ends here and you return to Earth. Or I stay here, help those poor beings and undo what our crew did. Choose wisely, Damn. Rachel. Our friend in the mist was very particular about the story of Ith. If I stay, I might be able to understand them more. I might be able to help them. But I'll never meet one of my own kind again. I'll Damn. never have a normal life. Slowly Whoa. I'll adapt and forget about humankind. Maybe, or I'll get homesick and spend the rest of my life in deep depression. Aww. And if we return to Earth, I may or may not find it to still be a living world. Too many years have passed. And even if people yeah, still live there, like, they will have evolved. You're not gonna be long be anyway. But even then, I might be able to find someone to live with. Or who knows what people will have evolved into. Maybe they'll just lock me in a cage. Oh no, Julia. So here's my I choice. mean, Rachel. <laughs> oh, I have to do this now? Can I? No! Let me go to the main menu! No! Ah, uh, I should have saved my save was so long ago. Oh, I want to purify the lake water. Very well. It's your decision. I want to purify it. Shit, I should Let's have seen. I didn't know. To our laboratory. We need to find some container to do this. I am not a suitable Damn. device for liquid transportation. And when you bring it back. Oh wait. Okay. Well. I think we have an ideal container to transport yep. that liquid to our probe's laboratory. Mobot, no. bring it to the underground lake. There we go. Hi, cistern. Fill the container. Alright, here we are. Yep. Mobot, fill the container and transport it to the probe's laboratory. As you wish. Let's just hope the formula works. Yep, we got one shot, basically. So how does it go? It will take quite some time to make it ready. Okay. What should we do? Just wait? No. We will travel to Ambrosia. I oh. believe it's going to be just enough time to produce the purifying liquid. Okay. Then... Ambrosia... No, that's Zenobia. Uh, here it is. So what's the current situation? Let me check the purification progress. Mm. We are all set. Are you ready? We've already sacrificed all our Arginium. Yeah, it's like, it's like you don't really I have a choice. I'm a deployment shuttle to start the purification process. 
really wish it would've let me save, man. Looks like a pencil. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, cool cutscene. Whoa. It kinda looks like such a small portion of the planet, but hey, probably has a big impact. Well, we saved them. It worked! The lake is clean again. So what is your plan now, Rachel? You know, I am an astrobiologist, so living on Ambrosia is a dream come true. Now there is enough pure water to support everyone, and I doubt I'll ever run out of this disgusting space food. <laughs> and who knows, I might find some of the Ambrosian food fit for human consumption. Either way, I will survive. Do you really want to live with those beings? Sure, there's so much to explore and... Julia, what's bothering you? The story of Ith. But it's probably nothing. Anyway, the oh. conditions to print and send down the station are not ideal. Story of Ith. I will have to send down a separate shuttle with some equipment. Then I will send Mobot down to collect the equipment and prepare a habitable place for oh, you. Oh yeah. Julia, you don't plan to leave me like you did to the others. Don't worry about that, Rachel. I will stay in touch. Um... Story of Ith. Oh yeah, wait, didn't Ith like come back and has been sent. he got Now killed? send Mobot down to collect it. Wouldn't leaving mean we go against Julia since she apparently wants what's best for life? Wait. Leaving... Leaving us in... Going back to Earth? I mean, I guess. Okay. Oh, wait, whoops. Yeah, they've been close to the and screw the erosions. Yeah. Not best for their life, that's for sure. So, uh, talk to the peeps. There's nobody in here. This is strange. Wait, what? Maybe they were scared away by the items we dropped off. That's possible. We should have warned them first. Observation. I can hear sounds coming from the area behind the cocoons. Hmm. There must be a hidden path leading from this village. Huh. The containers are empty. What happened to the cargo? No idea. We should investigate. What is going on? Yeah, we've never been further, have we? going on Imagine Julia just shows up behind Mobot. <laughs> oh. Oh, what the Oh. Uh-oh. Uh, uh oh. What on earth have I just seen? Do you remember the museum? You mean the one created I from remember my the story of We just Ith. witnessed exactly how Ith died. Uh oh. And they wanted to do the same to me. Do you really blame them, Rachel? Shit. Just remember the three punishments. Their original world was destroyed. That was a good point. They were to this jungle with poisoned water and approaching slow extinction. Then the humans came and shot them down like animals. Right. And that's all they would remember about your species. But I purify their water. They should- oh. They don't know you. Anyway, they think Mobot saved them. Shouldn't I- Shouldn't I descend? No, 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 no. After what you've just seen. Do not. <sighs> Point do taken. not. So what should we do? I've sacrificed all my Arginium stock. I'm stranded in this system forever. I don't think you will get bored. There is a lot of scientific research to do around here. I'm pretty sure we can find many things oh, worth exploring. <laughs> Alright, I give up. Let's get back to the probe. Ooh, maybe I should have learned from if I... <laughs> hey. Well. We do a good thing, but they just... make humans.
How are you, Rachel? Hmm? Hmm? What was that? Hello? What was that? But anyway, cool. It's a cool space exploration game. Humans suck. <laughs> wow. Well, that's... There's definitely, like, a lot to absorb. And I haven't really fully absorbed everything. Like, I've forgotten some of it. AI also suck. Yeah. Everyone except Rachel sucks. How <laughs> about that? <laughs> but okay, I... I still don't really... I still don't really understand why they made the artificial planet. Did I already forget? Or did they, did they not really explain it? Like... It's, yeah, I don't really get the point of that planet. Like... All we got there was the liquid, right? Is that basically the only thing we got from that mechanical planet? The purifying liquid? Well, like kind of like a small sample of it, so we got the recipe of it or whatever. So, yeah, I'm trying to piece it together in my head. But, like, it's not really working. <laughs> there was that weird liquid development system from the planet, which when it was already being developed, exactly. And what's with the... Like, there was that green interface thing next to where we were mixing things. And it kind of looked like a being that was, like, slowly rising or evolving it kind of looked like an erosion actually so i don't really get why it was there but yeah hooray we finish doesn't seem like that great of an ending though <laughs> maybe you should have just gone back because fuck your bridges <laughs> no i mean i mean it was the humans that kind of just destroyed their place but it sucks for Julia. I mean, Rachel, even though she gets to do a bunch of research. But she can never interact with the Ambrosians directly. Because otherwise, it would have just killed her. Wait, what about the credits? Did you miss a funny? <laughs> but you'll see in names. Was there, like, a funny username or something? Hmm. To my wife that watched me swear whenever it really has math crush? <laughs> That's amazing! Oh my god, I can't believe I missed that. Well, anyway. Hmm, that's a- it's a lot of people here. What does- what does space hackers mean? What do astronomers mean? Are they, like, tiers of supporters, maybe? That didn't make sense. Hmm. Yeah, I'm just thinking about it all. So, when... When did they... When did the humans think of destroying the entire race? I guess it was when they went to Ambrosia? Because... I mean, that's kind of what... Julia implied, like... She was like, oh, you, did, you didn't really go to Ambrosia? She said to Rachel, right? She do in Mobot? I mean, cool trick, but what? <laughs> um... Fuck. 
Oh, we could go to decision. Oh, well, ain't that handy? I'm eager to hear. All right. It just auto. You it just auto does it. Okay, let's check out what decision. happens Without, if we just if go back. Do this. As we've yeah, choose, that's really well, nice. I choose wise. If I stay, I might be able to understand. Them. I'll never have. slowly. I'll and if we were too many years, but even that, or who knows? So here's. Try to return to Earth. Let's well. just see what happens. It's your decision after all. Thank you, game. I will prepare an interface for the way home. Let's bring Mobot on board. Let's just see what happens. Maybe you yes, can get a glimpse of her. I haven't seen it for ages. Wow! Are you really sure you want to return? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I just hope that someone is still there, waiting for me. Uh, let's see, you've been gone for a while. I don't know if anyone's waiting for you, but I think there will still be people here. The Earth, also known as the Earth and the world, is probably still home to millions of species. Probably. Let's Good see. Good night, Rachel. I will wake you up when you are home. Good night, Julia. Is she gonna wake us up? I don't trust her. Let's see. Let's leave this place. Yep, let's go home. Let's see what happens. Oh wait, you have You have to sleep. Oh no. Because we're too far. You have to sleep. It just takes that long to travel. I don't know if we're waking up. Mm. I don't know if Julia's gonna wake us up. Don't trust her. I don't know. Hmm. I mean, the only reason she killed the others was because they wanted to murder the Ambrosians, right? But I guess by not helping the Ambrosians, Julia might turn against us because... I just don't like how it immediately went to the credits after making the choice. Yeah, same. And there's no after credits scene, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, it's really sus. Well, I'm really glad that they put the save right before the decision then, because, like, it would suck if you just chose that and you had to go, like, all the way back. But, yeah. I don't think Julia's gonna be waking us up because by going to Earth, we just killed the Ambrosians. At least that's how she sees it. Hmm... That's that. And that was Julia Among the Stars. But yeah, the other ending seemed a bit more fruitful, I guess. There was also that one alien creature you extracted from that water planet and never saw again. Well, yeah, it's with us. It's with us. Ju Rachel can just investigate it whenever. But yeah, uh, anyway... Alright, so that was Julia Among the Stars. We finished the game, yay! Anyway, hope you all had fun on that journey. It's a lot of interesting space exploration. And of course, the robot was evil in the end. What's new, right? <laughs> well, Mobot did nothing wrong. <laughs> Julia is the bad one. But yeah, that's another series finish. Hope you all enjoyed. Tomorrow, I will be continuing my Baldur's Gate 3 Wizard-only playthrough. So, hopefully, I'll see y'all there. Um, I did a few things off-stream, but, like, I didn't really talk to anyone. I just, like, took some items, sold stuff, all that good shit. And I dropped everyone out in new outfits, and you'll you'll be able to see that tomorrow. Same time as my usual streams, 8pm GMT plus 8. But yeah, rest well, my dear fairies. And hopefully I'll see y'all next stream. Stick around for the raid in the offline screen if you want some channel points. Bye-bye!